Hello and welcome to the International Space Station. We've been thinking a lot about the holidays that are coming up and I wanted to check in with my crewmates and just start talking about that holiday season. Johnny, what does Thanksgiving mean to you? Yeah, Thanksgiving for me is always a time to kind of pause and slow down and reflect on our lives, the people we cherish in our lives, and all the support we've had on this journey. In particular for this year, I get to spend it up with you all up here in space, so um, I feel very blessed and honored to share that time with you, but at the same time, think a lot about my friends and family and everyone who supported me along this journey, and I think if I had to choose one word, it's just gratitude. I'm very, very grateful for that. Kimia, what does Thanksgiving mean for you, and, and what are you looking forward to doing up here okay. for Thanksgiving? Yeah. san thank you for asking. Uh, we don't have any like Thanksgiving in Japan, but since here, ISS, everybody respects each other's culture internationally, so I really respect uh, Thanksgiving. Uh, that's very good tradition. Uh, show, I mean, show some like respect and also like appreciation to others. So I'd like to yeah enjoy that holiday, and actually looking forward to eat some like a special dinner or something like that. In, in, yeah, for the U.S. So do you have any like a special plan, you guys, for the food? Yeah, for the food. So m one of my favorite parts of Thanksgiving. This is my second Thanksgiving in space, so I highly recommend it. Uh, last time was with, uh, with, with the shuttle crew, and uh, it, was, it was amazing. And this time it's going to be with the new Soyuz crew, and we're getting food ready. Uh, so we have, like, the traditions of, of, of turkey. There's some cranberry sauce here. In fact, I'm going to just toss these out a little bit. This cranberry sauce is actually kind of Russian cranberries, so it's kind of neat to have that up here because that's one of the, my favorite parts. And uh, I'm going to miss my family, of course, and, uh, but I'm, I'm up here with my, with my space family, and it's really awesome. And uh, so we're looking forward to the, to the food up here and the, and the company. And uh, Zena, is this the only food we have? <laughs> Well, I know, Mike, this is not the only food we have. I think food is a really important part of everyday life up here and staying happy and healthy, and we share a lot of meals, and so this one's just going to be extra special. And our ground teams and the food lab at NASA have taken such great care of us that we have a very special uh, food holiday bag here. We've got everything from turkey and the traditional things that Mike mentioned, some mashed potatoes, to crab meat, salmon. We've lobster. even got some lobster, which is amazing. So I think it's going to be a really, really delicious meal, and I can't wait to share it with everyone, including our new crewmates who are launching on a Soyuz rocket on Thanksgiving Day. That's going to be really exciting. <laughs> Yeah, this is uh, marking also the end of your mission with us, Johnny. And so thinking about our new crew members coming up and sharing that Thanksgiving meal together, how does that make you feel? Um, I think the best way to show what that makes me feel is to just show up. <laughs> <laughs> Love you guys. Yeah. And from all of us aboard the International Space Station, we wish you all a happy Thanksgiving from space. May you spend it with your friends and family, enjoy the good food, and appreciate all the great things that we have in our lives. Thank you so much.